In this video, we'll walk you through the verification process in Binance. In order to purchase your chosen cryptocurrency directly from the exchange, you'll need to first verify your identity on the platform. This walkthrough will show you how to verify your basic info, and then the ID and face verification. This view is the main dashboard after logging into your account from a web browser. Hover over your account icon, and then select identification. This will bring up your basic info page. If you're a new account, you'll first have to verify your basic information before you can move on to ID and face verification. Click the verify button under basic info to load the personal information page. Binance will need you to enter your first name, middle name, last name, and date of birth. It also needs to verify your residential address, postal code, and country or region. I'm going to fill that stuff in now, and then hit the begin verification button at the bottom of the screen. If all is good, you'll get a success page for your basic information. Now we can move on to verifying our ID and face. The verification process is used to protect your identity from theft. It's also used for the exchanges, like Binance, to comply with customer ID and anti-money laundering laws. Basically, so that they can't get shut down by the SEC. Let's go through this process now by clicking the start button. Here is where you'll choose the type of identification to use in the verification process. For this account, I'm going to use my driver's license, but you also have the option to use a passport or identity card. To submit your driver's license, you can either upload a photo, take a picture with your laptop camera, or take a picture with your smartphone camera. I'm going to use my laptop camera to take the picture of my government ID. The next page will give you some tips to take the best picture. Make sure your room is well lit, and the driver's license is centered on the screen. Your browser will ask you for permission to access your web camera. Click allow. I'm going to take a picture of the front of my driver's license first. If you like the photo you took, and it's clear and legible, hit confirm to move to the next step. If you didn't take a good picture, hit the retake button. Now we'll take a picture of the back part of the driver's license. If the photo is clear, hit confirm. The last step on this page is to take a selfie, so they can match your face with the face on your ID. Let's click complete to finish the ID verification. The final step is one more facial verification. For this, you can either use the Binance app, or continue to verify it in your browser. I'm going to stick with the session in this browser. For this, you'll have to allow access to the camera again. Keep your face in the center of the bubble, and wait a moment until the live detection starts. You'll have to move your head slowly from side to side until the green bar fills the outer edge of the circle. This is to ensure that you are a real active person, and not just using old pictures to verify the account. The facial identification process may take a bit, because it's a manual process. Meaning it's reviewed individually by their support team, and it can usually take 7 to 10 business days to confirm. So roughly 2 weeks. But you still may be able to purchase Bitcoin on their platform before that time. If this video helped you out, don't forget to use the referral link in the description below. Clicking the link will give you a 10 to 20% commission kickback on all Binance trades. Thanks for watching.